guys and welcome back to my channel I hope you guys are doing well I hope y'all are y'all look good um so I got feedback from the last time you lot didn't like my decorations so I'm gonna get <laughs> with something um this is a gift bag whoa I just spat that's disgusting I'm eating, I'm eating popcorn so it came out and you didn't ask anyway back to what I was saying this is this gift bag I thought let me do something that match a little bit more so is the gift bag is it cute or do you guys have decoration suggestion I don't like plants so nobody should come and ask me to go and get plants because I don't like plants I don't like I don't like it as you have seen by the title of this um, um video we're gonna be talking about some tips and tricks to lockdown number two <laughs> guys we're actually in lockdown number two do you know that this world, this year, is like what they call quarantine, quarantine. That is double quarantination. Quarantination, which is an extended value of quarantine plus nation equals quarantination. Just a, you have to laugh. We are going to go into lockdown 2.0. And why I'm calling it lockdown 2.0 is because we're going to do better. Guys, we need to do better this lockdown. And I don't have anything to do. I never do like makeup and hair because I don't have time. It's just all tragic scenes. Um, and I'm gonna try and explain why it's tragic scenes in this clip. No, but guys, it's actually all tragic scenes over here. Like, I can't, like, part, I can't. Do you know how many times I tried to part my hair today? Nah, this is actually dead. Mm. Okay, so I need to, like, it's not even a disclaimer. I've just had enough. What can I do to put in my hair that will actually relax my hair, guys? Because nothing works. I have relaxed my hair how many times this year? And most people, every time I see somebody, they tell me, is your hair even relaxed? Lizzie has had, I've had enough. I'm trying to be a, a relaxed babe in peace. I need help. So if you guys have, cause I'm trying to, I'm trying to, you know, be a babe. You understand? But life is not like, life, ooh, life is not trying to let me be a babe. What's going on? Anyway, that's not what today's video is about. Anyway, so, uh, you know, lockdown number one tip. No, lockdown, lockdown, whoa, lockdown 2.0 tip number one. Yeah, guys, we got to eat better. I know I'm just supposing it right now because me, I'm eating popcorn, but no, I've not eaten today, and it's already like 3 p.m. or something, so this is okay. We, um, we gotta be disciplined in what we eat. Let's be honest, because in lockdown number one. I don't we hate you you hate you hate isn't it you hate a lot I ate uh -uh. I ate at godly hours ungodly hours so guys we need to eat better and I don't mean by just eating hundred times a day but eating actual good food um because I can't tell you the amount of um snacks and takeaway that I had a lot, I didn't have money, so I don't know where that takeaway was coming from. You know why you need to know why? Because let me talk to you guys. I'm gonna to talk to you for real, for real. Some of you, you are made to come out of that lockdown engaged. <laughs> Some of you were made to come out of that lockdown in your relationship. Some of you were made to come out of that relationship a billionaire. I mean, come out lockdown a billionaire. But you didn't do it because you didn't eat well. You didn't sleep right. <laughs> so be intentional about what you put in your stomach. Because some of you are meant to be marriage. <laughs> some of you, you are not meant to be single right now. Some of you are. No, 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 let's not be stupid. Some of you are supposed to be single right now. So don't be, don't be thinking stuff. You know, God's time is the best and everything. But some of you are supposed to be a committed to your marriage after the lockdown, but no, because you hit too so much, he couldn't do it. Mudaro, what you get me say? Hey, number two tip, lockdown number two tip is try, try to do something, and I don't mean hello. I said on my Instagram, I put my Instagram here. I said on my Instagram, it's not that you need to go and start business if God have not give you business. So to get, because if you go and do business, some of you need to understand that some of you, you want to do business, you want to do entrepreneurship, but that entrepreneurship, that business can lead you to a darker place. Oh. Uh. Eh. Uh. Because let's not lie, some of us, we have reached some dark places in lockdown. And sometimes we think that the more we do, 
it will take away the problems of our lives. No, that's not the case for everybody. Some of you, you need to find something to do in terms of do not be idle. So it may be that you learn something new. And I don't mean like, exactly, I don't mean like you got to go and invest in business. Bitcoin, now I say you traders, leave us alone. We don't want to trade. Some of us, we don't want to trade. We don't want to, we don't want it. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. Shit, I'm so... Yeah? So even if you find a new hobby, you know, you learn how to, to cook. If you're not, if you're not really in, if you like cooking, and you want to learn how to make better dishes like i said let me they take away learn how to make what you want to buy do you get what i mean if it's learning how to sew learn how to sew if it's um, reading up on a new course read up on that new, do that new course if it's reading a book if it's reading read your book it's all about improving yourself so find something to do so even if it's improving your mentality like i said improving your mental state find something to do that will improve your mental state it's not necessarily about who is the most productive no because that's where people have led that straight because you are going on instagram and twitter and snapchat and you are seeing people are flourishing and people are doing new things hello we are not the same i at all i at, we are different you are you he is him but some of you you need to start a business some of you you need to take that risk and start what it is you've always wanted to start. This is the time to do it. I think someone said it, 2020 um, wasn't the year we envisioned, but it's the year that opened our vision to see that, listen, life is for the living. Life, um, it can just, life can do you at any point. And you know, take, seize the moment. Seize the, 2020 said seize the moment. Use what you have because the government will fail you. Answers! <laughs> it's not funny, but, and SARS, do you get what I mean? Um, the UK, the government will fail you. That's what I'm trying to tell you. The government will look at America, look at the UK, look at Nigeria, look at Africa. Just look at the world. The government will actually fail you. So you cannot put your trust in the government. The only trust you can do is put your trust in God. So yeah, if there's something that you've always wanted to do, you should do, you have to do it because we don't know. We don't know what 2021 has in stock for us. That's it, number three. Tip number three of this lockdown. Some of us, <laughs> we need to start looking better. Shut up, that's an insult. In terms of, I think a tip that will actually help a lot of us is try not to get comfortable being bummy. Cause I think for me especially, I was so, like I realized that my days weren't as great because I already started the day down like i would you know let my my hair would be in <laughs> my i wouldn't look after my skin i wouldn't like i said i wasn't looking after looking at what i was eating i wouldn't dress like appropriately like this this right now this is miraculous because on my day to day obviously i'm at home but sometimes feel do things that make you cute do you know what i mean like if it's a manicure a pedicure a wash a, a, a nice long soak in the bar you know don't let yourself go is what i'm trying to say like really try and take care of your physical appearance so my tip number three is make sure that you're looking after yourself you know you pamper yourself a little bit Num tip number four is make sure that you are communicating um this lock this lockdown 2.0 talk to your friends talk to your family make sure that you're constantly in communication even when you don't feel like it even when you don't feel like um talking to someone obviously in that in that very moment if you don't want to talk to somebody then brother <laughs> brother don't talk to them talk to jesus um but when you if it's becoming a pattern where you've not spoken to somebody for more than a day even i think you should force yourself to even you know speak to somebody um you know even if it's just banter even if you don't don't talk about the problems of life don't talk about the problems of the you know call somebody and banter watch something and laugh you know laughter is oh aki oh pataki oh pataki you know it's very important to laugh tip number five i don't know i i think one five i think one five is try to try to remain positive try to remain positive because i know a lot of us the first time we see look we hear lockdown we hear quarantine i mean it's not good what's going on in the world you know but i do believe that um we should try and find positivity in everything i know it's hard hello you're talking i know it's hard i know it's difficult but i think 
it's important for us to try and find positivity in the small things i think you have to appreciate the small things so whether it be that you get an extra hour of sleep or whether it be that you get that privilege to work from home so you don't have to you know spend money on um travel and and stuff i feel like you have to try grasp at every um positive thing that you can especially in this season because you know i do believe that um one this year is not a mistake it had to happen for a reason for us to realize certain things you think obviously y'all know i'm a believer so um the bible talks about about us having joy in the midst of our trials in the midst of whatever goes on we're not promised you know a life that's easy you know there will be difficult there will be trials. um and number two i think this is gonna be my last tape tip number six or whatever number we are do you even know a believer or you're a believer i will encourage you to pray it's just the only thing i think prayer is so it's so freeing so amazing i think i've worshipped well physically what i worship every day my lifestyle is worship hello hello scripture <laughs> But um, I think it's important to also spend time in the presence of God. I think that's that's even that's the most important thing I can advise anybody is to spend time in the presence of God. So even whether you're a believer or you're not a believer, I think it's important to I think you should pray. I think you should try it, even if you don't know what to say. I think you should just set aside, set aside, set time aside and literally just pray and literally just speak to God which is so if you don't know what prayer is it's literally just communicating and speaking to God if you're not a believer you're just like God I don't I don't know if you are real I don't know if you are Lord you can see what's going on in this in this world in this whatever help me speak to me let me know that you're real and I promise you God will reveal himself to those that want him to reveal the himself to them and so definitely I'll encourage you to pray and if you are a believer I encourage you to play pray um worship worship spend time in his prayer and spend time in his word and um, those are you know life-changing established things that have helped me and um, that I will definitely encourage you guys to do do things that will encourage you do things that will encourage somebody else like I said don't neglect your friends don't neglect your family don't neglect the people around you um, watch shows um, go ahead, watch time watch some shows give me some shows to watch I don't mind that but I hope that's helped you guys but yeah, because some of you, like I said, you need to come out of this lockdown mind. <laughs> some of you, I'm saying it, this lockdown 2.0, I feel like they're going to extend it because our lockdown is on this December the 2nd, but I think they might extend it. And if they do, God is working, isn't it? Let's just believe that God is working. And if they extend it, guys, you people, I know who I'm talking to. I'm talking to you you need to come out of this lockdown <laughs> engaged <laughs> with your second kid i mean no married with your second kid you i'm really really joking ain't nobody trying to rush nobody in these streets god's time is the best to wait on god when the lord says it's time for you to be in a relationship you'll be in a relationship when the lord says it's time for you to start a business you will start that business should get so you guys in my next so you guys in my so you guys in my video make sure you like you comment you subscribe you do all that great stuff